So we're just in production phase. Um, but Chico's cutting all the metal for the frame, so tomorrow we're gonna start tacking together the frame, and then we'll finally have our first like big piece of what we've been working on. So these are the linkages of the sculpture, and they're gonna pivot off of these axle points. So I'm just getting these axles punched, and then we'll have our first two. There's like. 40 tubes in, in, a, in a border crosser. So this is number one of 80. <laughs> this, this border crosser speaks to an idealism and, and an attempt to make progress, to um, overcome hurdles or obstacles uh, that stand in the way. And institutionally, we go through that same thing. Each of these schools, e each department has its own way of doing things. Um, students come from all different backgrounds and um, they're all different levels of expertise. And so it, it really becomes a microcosm for what it means to cross a border. I was born in China and then I moved to Singapore and growing up in Singapore and now I'm in America now. So I guess like, um, Having this international experience really gave me a sense that the world should be connected. Like, really, there should be no border. I, maybe this is this may sound wrong, but I guess I mean it makes more sense that the world needs to be more connected. So if you can focus on the wiring, and then we hook up the patch, and we can click the valves, we got like stage one okay. good, and then stage two would be uh, getting the info for the uh, wench yeah. and the potentiometer, okay. and uh, at least, you know, I think he can, he can, uh, that'll allow him to catch up on that.